Hello, my friend. Today is day 21 and challenge manifest your goal in 21 days. For me, it was just amazing. Things happen so fast and I'm excited to face even more upcoming um, miracles. So expect the miracles and please, you can put any topic to draw same thing for a few days, up to 10 days on one topic, it would be wonderful. 21 days, it was like long too for me, but it's good exercise to repeat it because it's easy and it works. You basically build up map for your subconscious, visualizing how it can be, visualizing what it is for you, so in this way, you send those pictures to subconscious when subconscious try to now connect all those energies together. So you be vibrating on the same level where you want to be with your goal. Is that amazing? I think it is. So thank you so much for uh, being with me and let's draw. Let me see what you can do. Do you remember how we started? We used to put us and buzzing goal around us and today the last day of the challenge i want you to just expand your goal like a star like a maybe like a flower put those triangles like around your goal so you shooting out this energy into the universe into society into people around you to stand out to shine out to shine up ah. so other words to just be more and be like really prepare your subconscious for this um for this move, for this um, step forward. And today, just let's just put out only positive, trust the process and focus on your goal. And I like to put this as a last picture of our challenge, just a circle. And the circle meaning I trust the process. I trust the process and I'm reaching my goal. And let's put number one here. And number two is enjoy the journey. Oh, and I like to put it here. So it's a beautiful journey. And it's like all oh, vibrating, vibrating beautifully. Amazing experience. So this is number two. And number three is having energy and motivation to move forward. So, and this is number three. Remember before we did uh, three questions and today just like that. So we all harmonize our feelings about our goal that yes, we are moving forward. We allow ourselves to feel good about our goal, to feel that, to trust the process, to trust the journey. So this is number three. Okay. Having enough motivation and energy. Okay. And remember those three circles. You also can put those three circles whenever you want and randomly number them four five six okay so just put those circles and put the numbers four five six four five and six okay this is what is for me and remember what we do 
we reprogram our neural connections. So more we think about our goal, more those neurons get together and fire up together because they have same feelings about things, feelings, energy. Remember, feeling energy, feeling it's uh, emotion, it's energy. So energy sparkle together. Like let's say um, if you doubt something and more and more um, proof you get from everywhere, this is like, like, you know, light bulb in your head. That's what they say. But that's a true. That's what happens. So they rewire together because they they find each other. And they stick together and grow into big connection. This is like a habit. So if you make a habit to be happy, to achieve things easy, to have an easy focus because you you know you're capable, you're inspired, and you do what you love to do. When you do what you love to do, you have all energy in the world. You have uh, energy that you just cannot sleep. You have so many ideas to move forward. And if you don't have it yet, that's okay. Keep moving. Keep finding this connection. Study something. Study. Find like-minded people. Go network. Uh, try to get your um, ideas out. Try to find some people who really like your idea. And those lines, actually, let's put out while I'm talking. So... Just put it out that all this for good. You have a purpose. And all you need to do is just visualize. Visualize. And visualize that you're already there. Enforce, reinforce those connections. Find more information about what you want. Um, connect um, and just, you know, just keep growing uh, knowledge about the topic you are interested. And this is so amazing. So, and after I put another line here, I will start to round the corners. And I feel so in inspired. I feel so, wow, so much energy. And I just want to put some more uh, what I want to point out. So, and see, I don't want to put it bigger because for me now, it's not a big deal to achieve this goal because I have so much trust. I have so much motivation and I have the I, and I am enjoying the journey I am look I'm enjoying the journey big time I'm so grateful so glad I'm so glad to experience what I'm going to through because I'm growing spiritually, I'm growing mentally, and my energy changed so much because I feel when I'm aligned with myself and I am manifesting much easier because I'm aligned and I'm connected with universe. My angels, my guides, my higher self, And those lines, that's it. I'm I put enough, I feel good about this. So now I start to run corners. And it's going to take me some time. And while I'm taking my time to run corners, I just thinking all positive, 
who positive outcome. I envision my beautiful dream home. I envision my workshops so popular and helpful for other people. I envision my my business growing. I envision more and more people using my videos to improve their own life. And that's why those videos are out there, because I love to share tools that help me. And that's why I'm sharing that with you, because I just realize how easy it is by drawing with your inner child, giving your inner child time to spend with you because we've been ignoring our inner child for a while by, by being busy and stressed and overwhelmed. Think about all that. And now you take your time, you draw with your inner child. And while you draw with your inner inner child, you just let go of the control and just sit and watch. How would you do it if you were just four years old? Remember how you are unpredictable for yourself. So let your pen just draw on its own. Because when you are a child, you are watching everything. You are watching how your marker or your pen creating something and only then you take control. But now we are connecting with the, our inner child on the very, very first moment when you just don't think about anything. And the same time, your inner parent can brainstorm about anything about business, about uh, planning, about how we buy a new house and how it can be, while your inner child envision what inner parent talk, inner talk. You see how interesting it is? And then inner child automatically uh, envision what it can be. Remember yourself when you be a child, you always interfere when parents talking. You say, oh, parents say, what, how, what, how big the house, three bedroom, four bedroom, and the child say, no, six bedrooms. And because inner child want, always want to be involved with inner parent to communicate that's how we learn to communicate with the world and when we come back to our inner child and inner parent game so to speak then when we balance them out then we have all this energy we have this harmonious connection that brings all this energy to manifest so and this is beautiful way to create by drawing like this and meditate kind of meditate on questions what you put it put out for yourself yeah don't lose the numbers i'm almost lost the number so in while you round the corners, okay, you think some ideas, some interesting opportunities that pop up in your head and just watch 
what is coming your way. And take notes and take as a consideration. This is your inner child interact and throw to you some kind of ideas. And your job as an inner parent to kind of watch your child. Maybe sometimes they say child is right. I don't know if you have the same. Or child speak the truth, something like that. Okay, so because our inner child very close have to to God, have that intuition. This is from come from inner child intuition. So in, in this um, drawing, you connect with yourself even deeper because you also connect with deeper with your ideas and thoughts and your business much deeper than you would do anyway and you can always stop for a second and write things down write those ideas down Very important to write down questions and answers. You ask the question, and by drawing on the question, you brainstorm about answers. And I'm totally mesmerizing myself in my process here. So, how are you doing? How are you feeling? I feel more calm. And I pretty much see my workshops and collaboration with other people. They're beneficial for everybody. So that's what I love to do. And also I work on my videos and I like to have 100,000 subscribers on this channel. And I would appreciate if you like my videos, please subscribe. And have a comment if you like. I do private sessions and workshops. Now I start to do workshops every Sunday. Let's see how it goes. So I really enjoy them. And I possibly grow very fast. And that's what those intentions I send out in each line, in each curve. So I program myself, I program my subconscious for success. I put all these beautiful words out. So my subconscious see it as safe place to be and move towards it because I show how many benefits I like to experience and my subconscious sees um, more benefits and then feel safe to move forward okay no procrastination 
And this is another way to look at when we don't move forward. It's more likely, or a lot of people don't like to take responsibilities. Yes, they dream about this, but it's also taking more. It's take more responsibilities, more of your time, possibly somewhere to keep it up, to grow your business, to be involved 100%. And really do it with joy because this is the only way to keep this energy up. And when you have this energy, yes, I know I'm talking like with no energy right now. But just because I'm kind of uh, calm down while I'm drawing, and trust me, yes, I feel relaxed, but I'm not too relaxed. I enjoy it a lot. So, and I'm pretty much done. And now I'm going to just color it. And let's see. Okay. Mm -hmm. And just go with the flow. Put the color on it. And again, just keep in mind that you here to shine. And when you allow yourself to shine, nobody can stop you. So allow yourself to shine. Should put yellow here. So. Okay. Oh, that's so small. Yeah, that's good. So yeah, and spell, spell, spell on yourself all these beautiful words. Because whatever you're talking, whatever words coming out of your mouth or you have your inner talk with, it's very important that that's how you treat your inner child. So think about that. Cheer yourself up more and more just love yourself be true to yourself that's even more powerful and understandable when you are true to yourself then your life becomes so much easier. When you just go with the flow, go with whatever is important for you. Yes, maybe you need to take a couple steps before you can start it, but you can plan it out and you can make it happen. So what is it for you? What is your goal for you? I didn't tell you what is um four five six four it's create okay four eight five visualize and six trust. Okay, and don't forget to put date. So, and we are almost ready. I probably add just a blue one. I don't want to put too many colors in there. Let's see. Okay. 
And again, I like to put the color stand in the flow mode. Go from one side to another. Maybe something here. Maybe. Okay. So what you're reading, how do you feel? So, yeah, and you can continue on your own. And now I like to do meditation before I let you go. Please finish your picture and Take, take a moment, sit straight, kind of move on your, uh, on your booty from one side to another, massage your butt a little bit, keep your back straight, make it inhale and rise up your shoulders, and just let them down. I am glad you stay with me 21 days. So that was amazing experience for me at least. And I suggest that doing the doing by doing this again, like I said in the beginning, at least five or you know, ten times, if it's really, really burning you something, it really will shift your energy to another level because you refocus in a certain way that your neurons start to change your life around you is that amazing or what so we basically connect to the dimension by thinking what we want and the same vibration so we need to align ourselves with this vibration so we need to vibrate in a certain way and those drawings helping you to align what you how you vibrate about this and bring you your manifest what you want faster and this is proven method. If you go on the internet, you can find so many proven uh, amazing stories that by drawing, by reprogramming your neurons, you reprogram your reality. That's amazing. So welcome to fifth dimension. It's easy, it's possible. And those the tools like this will help you to shift. And you, if you're watching this video, that means you are searching that what it can help you to wake up, to wake up to something that you want to understand and you don't understand yet. And what is it? What is it? What is it within you that burning? So you're going to find an answer because all answers within you. If you have a question, you have an answer. And we all have different keys to open different doors within us to explore more, to understand more ourselves. And when we understand ourselves, then we align better with our reality, with our future. And for our subconscious, it's no future or past. For our subconscious, it's all now. Because if I tell you, sit quiet, close your eyes, and remember your past, your past will be pulled out from the from the that shelf and would be open now in the real time you experience what you you would you experience back then same thing for our subconscious it doesn't matter when in the future or now so why don't we focus on our future and live our future and really be mindful about what we think how we speak what we um what words we talk out, how we plan, how we dream, because we need to be there, almost like, imagine that's so strong that you're physically there. Okay, so now let's do a little meditation. 
close your eyes. Make a deep inhale and slowly exhale. Breathe comfortably. And now you look down on a playboard. And this playboard is your present moment. And you can see all what's going on around you, like on a play, um, I don't know how you call it, desk board, play board. So you can see the process almost instantly about what's going on with your life around you, what you dream about, how things are going. And you can tell what is missing because you can see everything and it's you, it's your life. What is missing? Is it schedule? Is it possibly promising things and not doing things to yourself, first of all? It is possibly what it is for you? And answer this question for you. And what would you do different? Look over all this game you play right now. What would you do different to enhance your life right now? What is easy steps you can take to change your life for the best? And now listen to all this ideas, all these possibilities come in your way and allow those ideas flow your way in a perfect time, in a perfect moment, constantly. That's it. You open the door now. Constantly. You need an answer. You get it. You get it. Quick. Breathe. What is it for you? What are those pictures coming up your way? Look at those pictures and feel it. What is real good idea for you? And you can open your eyes and write it down and close your eyes and keep watching those ideas, how they unfold for you. And allow those ideas come in your way. Allow those people come in your way, give you more ideas, opportunities, and possibilities. And now imagine you see another board where you already very successful and happens to you and look back what steps you took to achieve your goals and obvious steps will be shown right away to you and little maybe steps that you never thought about now you see them. Focus on one topic. Follow this topic. How would you be very successful there? And what steps you took to be there? And collect all this information. And you stay open for those ideas that will come to you from your future ideas, from your 
coming up from 5D reality. Breathe and collect all this information that comes your way. It comes your way with divine love and be unfold for you in a perfect time and a perfect place. In harmony. All the good. And now you can stay in this space, collect information, enjoy the outcome, enjoy the benefits of your persistence, your energy to move forward, your goals, your wishes and your desires. And stay in this very positive, empowered movie that you can see yourself laughing and having so much energy and being the best of you can ever be and have the best you ever want to have. And it's so easy for you. It flows your way naturally just because, just because you allow yourself to dream one day. That's why you can. Ask and you will be given. And I recommend for you to stay here for some time. And when you're ready, you can open your eyes. And I will see you in the future videos.